Ah, oh, so many secrets and so many, uh, there's just so much going on right now. And then it's just like the first town. Can't wait to get out of here, honestly. <laughs> Okay, I went out the wrong door, but that's all right. That's a volcano. That's a pretty volcano. I wonder how far that spreads. Oh, hello. What? No. Oh. Trade. I wonder if I can turn it off. I'll just use my pistol until... Because I don't want to... What should I call it? I don't want to waste it. The shock. Mine. Mine. Give me. Give me. Stop reloading your fucking gun. Uh, Kane Van Acker. Acker. Spacer's Choice Ethologist. Assigned to Terra 2. This week I've decided to study... The... Terroray mating habits. The female terror rays leave, a, leave their nesting area in the morning or turn the afternoon for random objects, typically something shiny or bright. Then they build displays with these objects. With displays with these objects and perform what you can only dis <laughs> describe as a dance of for an audience of ma males. If a male likes what he sees, the two go off and nest together in the one nearby of the trees. Gerald, if you're reading this, I'm done waiting for you. Collect my things and meet me at this next site. And don't be late. I expect punctuality from my assistance. Ooh! Ooh! Um. He did. He gone. Where? I killed something else, didn't I? It was like. God! I didn't mean to jump across the fucking earth! Whatever this is called, Emerald Valley, whatever. Where is that one other thing that I killed? Mine. Give me all your parts. God damn it. Ah oh, shit, I probably could have taken off this fucking thing, huh? Ooh, maybe I, I'm gonna go back. Eh. 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 No, there it is. I might go back and fucking take off this stupid scope. I don't like it. I pistols on scopes don't make any sense in my brain. What? This bitch. Are you joking? But it's... Mm. Fine. <laughs> that is dumb. I should be able to take that off. What is this? Oh, that's what these little boxes are? Is that right? Or are the... Where are these boxes? <gasps> I've missed so much! What? What do we have to keep our heads down for? Jeremy's a good guy, all right. He, he's not going to hurt us. Oh, it looked like a fucking animal. Let me in. Let me in. Maybe I can just... Eh. Ah.
Ah, shit. Alright. I can do this, don't worry. God damn it. Just jump up. I know you can. I know you can, bro. You fucking. Eh. Close enough. Haha! -ha. I nailed it. Sweet. Botanical lab. <gasps> I'm going to use my stick. Hello. Eh, eh. Retreat. Swap through eight weapons. Oh, hi. Is this your pet? That's awesome. Oh God. Everyone all right? Oh, is that it? That's all we got? <laughs> Weak. Tamed cannon. Can't open this. I can open all the yellow ones though. Marauder Vandal. Oh. Nice. Thank you. I appreciate the praise. <clears throat> My back. Don't mind me. I'm just dying. Ah. <sighs> oh. I wish I could take off this fucking scope, dude. Hello? Oh, ah! I'm falling. Primal nest discovered. Primal nest? Hello? Is there a primal nest nearby? Oh. I'm probably gonna- I- I'm probably above them. Oh, it's underneath me. Okay. Gotcha. I don't really want to go and die, but I, I, I kind of want to- I want to see. Primal Hunter. H hello Oh god! Oh shit! Fuck that! <laughs> We're running! Bravati, get the fuck out of there! <laughs> Woo! No! Come on! Get out of there! <laughs> oh! That dude disappeared. There he is. Woo! What you doing? Don't you do it! Provati, you gotta, you gotta get the fuck out of there, girl. At least you took the aggro for the most of it. God damn! <laughs> they fucking keep flying out of that fucking hole like a fucking clown car, man. There was a lot of them. I thought there was only like three. Oh, I don't have enough picks. Oh, no. Excuse me while I go into circles. What is this? Heavy ammo? I take ammo. Straight. Straight. Botanical lab. What's this? Oh, took it. Straight. Move along, stranger. We don't want any trouble. Oh, wait. Hold up. Hold up. Hello. I don't know you. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. Move along. I'm not. I'm just. Answers, huh? You must be one of those philosophicals. Already got ourselves one of those. Uh, Reese says something about former workers. Oh God, I'm looking for the geothermal plant. Yeah, that's us. And you can tell Thompson we're doing just fine by ourselves. If you're gonna start wandering around my camp, 
know that I got my sights on you. Over in the hothouse. Yeah, where is this person? Enough with the questions. No offense, but I've got a lot on my mind. No worries. Well, look at you. Buzzing around the Aether with your very own ship. Rest of us gotta make do with the ground at our feet. That's fair. No, I'm sorry. That was unworthy of me. Lady named Zoe went missing some nights ago. Just up and vanished without a trace. Now I'm pacing around wondering if Marauders got to her. I'll keep an it's eye not out. I like Zoe to go wandering. Figured she might be out scavenging, but that ain't exactly her talent. Can't imagine where she's gone. Vale's a wide place. She could be anywhere. Yeah. Yeah, let's say that there are fucking parts of her all over the places. God. Honest. Yeah, I'll keep my eye out, bro. I got some I questions. I, I got questions, though. No. Um. Vex me. If she told anybody, they ain't telling me. I'd check her room, but I got yelled at for snooping once already. Little ways ago, she was always obsessing over her serial dramas. Wanted to see what the fuss was about. Could be. Dangers are plenty out there. No telling why marauders would steal somebody like Zoe. Got no useful skills, far as I can tell. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, enough to know we never got on. Zoe and Stefan were close. If anybody knows the workings of her mind, he does. Okay. What is it? Uh, no, I just wanted to fucking leave the conversation. Oh, they got themselves a little... A little place here. Very nice, very nice. A bong. Hello? Oh, I skipped what she said. Spit outside. If you're bearing illness, find a place to lay your head down and I'll fetch you a poultice. Whatever your troubles with Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? I have been called that, among other things. Green Thumb, Grandmother, the strange old lady who keeps flowers. But yes, Adelaide will do just fine. That's how you pronounce her name. Excuse me, Miss McDevitt? Sorry, it's just... You got such pretty trees in here. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. Thomas speaks of you often. Are you staying long? You should try some of my tobacco-horn tea. Ew. I brew it in an old spittoon, but it's been clean. Looks a like you made a home. Anyone who's ever turned their backs on Edgewater. A home for those of us with nowhere left to go and nothing to lose. So, like the spores of the puffball, cast on the wind and alighting on fresh soil, we put down new roots. But why? It's an unpleasant story, dear. But the short of it is that sometimes one wakes up and realizes the place that was once her home for much of her life has changed. The home in which we spent our lives has left us behind, and so we must move on. And that is as much as I will say on the subject. Oh dear, the garden belongs to us all. Life is the gift of the universe, and the universe yields its bounty equally, absent of prejudice. Damn. The soil around the Vale went sour years ago, but I found a way to sweeten it back up. The secret recipe is a little bit of elbow grease, a dash of love, and a heaping pile of special fertilizer. Oh, God. <sighs> um... Read to 
Hobson? You here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? I'm not. What's Reed's idea of peace then? Stealing your power? Like everything else that comes out of Edgewater, that peace offering is canned. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. Hey, Amen. He would do such a thing. Yeah. The question is, why would you agree to his plans? Cannery's got a regulator. You want ship parts, you ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. If you're going down to the plant, you should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. Think about it. We'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service to that odious cannery. Seems the sort of thing a hero would do. All right, you sweet talker. A hero to you, maybe. What have you got against this town? I mean, I have a lot of issues, and I just barely got here. But... Their lives away at the cannery, living off whatever scrap spacer's choice throws them. You know that's true, don't you, Miss Holcomb? Your father died of overwork. His heart gave out. He he was tired all the time, sure, but he was old, ma'am, and he raised me all by his lonesome. Look what they did to this child. Lost her family to the company, and still she defends them. Fuck! What happens? Life in Edgewater grinds to a halt. The cannery shuts down, workers desert in droves, and our own little camp grows and thrives. I trust you will listen to your conscience. Fuck me, dude. What do you think? Yeah, huh? What do you think? You mean about the mission being too clean? I know, but Vicar says the universe is a machine, that it runs by law. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Real machines have gunked up oil scratches and worn bits you can tell they've seen handling been used by folk the machine vicar sees is one ain't never been run it, it's not for people to live in it's something on a museum shelf under glass interesting never been much for religion myself something higher and greater than us but I don't feel it when I'm in the mission. Sorry. I know it's none of my business. Bruh, you're on, like... Uh... It's not like I think it a failing, mind. It's just I... I live right across the road. Most nights I watch folks out my window. Oh, I see. Here, they might be happy or sad. Mostly they're tired. I've been ignoring you the entire time. Where they stumble into the alley and I listen to their hearts breaking. Maybe so. But we don't think on it that way. Yes, you do. Don't even. Don't even with me. I'm not gonna steal anybody's shit. We have got a lot of trees. I didn't notice that that Edgewater didn't have any trees. Blech. Damn it. A few kindred spirits. Hello. You hungry? We got canid ribs, canid flank, canid snout too. Something I can help you with? Yeah. You mean Zoe? Yeah, we were pretty close. Not like her to go loping off. What happened? Zoe and I were gonna watch the cereals, as is our custom. She never turned up. I looked around, but she was nowhere to be found. 
You sound like some type of corporate fixer asking all these questions. Corporate fixer? Zoe was always obsessed with this cereal. Masked Marketeer. A scion of Byzantium turns to banditry and teaches his marauder companions the wisdom of free market economics. What? Shame she up and vanished when she did. I had a surprise lined up for her. The other day I got my hands on a genuine copy of the latest Masked Marketeer. I was gonna surprise Zoe with it, but she was gone the next day. Hmm. Can't say I recall Zoe ever acting strange. Well, except for her habit of writing things down on scraps of paper. She called it journaling, but I think it's just plain odd. Okay. Hey, I got time. Okay. What are you selling? Fresh off the limb, and that includes canid meat. Your merchant skill is equal to the value of your best dialogue skill and is used to negotiate prices when buying and selling from vendors. So I can haggle. Amazing. Repair equipped. Whoa. Sell junk. Hell yeah. Can I compare it with my ship? Oh. Interesting. Oh, did I? Oh, fuck. I picked up shit, didn't I? God damn it. That has the best armor, I believe. Hell yeah. Alright. Hold up. Hold. Hold your chicken nuggies. I've got a lot of stuff. Okay, so I just sold all my junk. Beautiful. Hello. Tra trade trade me limb. trade me shit. And just that sh I don't care. Sell. I want to sell this and this wait god damn it i need to figure out if she has good stuff too fuck pravati what are you wearing oh i don't have to worry about what she's wearing sweet something i can help you with yes i need you to take all my clothes fresh off the limb and that includes canid meat sell sell these sell Soul, soul, beautiful. I have a lot of weapons. Uh, I need you to take some, I think. Yeah, let's sell that one. Okay, okay, it's not letting me sell any of the stuff that I have equipped. Gotcha. That makes it a lot better. Something I can help you with? Uh, trade. Fresh off the limb, and that includes. Trade! Trade. Okay, whew. At least that cleared up. Oh, fuck me. It's fine. It's fine. She's fine. Alright, so this is Zoe's room. Um. Alright. Fuck me. 